Hey, Capricorn. This month is and can be a time of great joy. There's something about getting your work done. Like, do your day-to-day. -day, do what you need to do. But mostly experience the independence, the security, the feeling, relish in how you feel, regardless of who's around. You might want to keep your bubble a little small, but enjoy everything that you've created, the risk that you've taken, that you continue to, and will. The what you've built for yourself, what you've created for yourself, are in the midst of creating for yourself, the longevity. And just think, do your day-to-day, -day, what you need to do, but also know that you're stable. Know that regardless of what happens, your identity is stable. And I think that's what's most important to you right now. However, you can still change and have your identity be stable while you just become more of who you are. You're not promising anyone that you are a certain way. You can still be loyal. You can still be honest. You can still be someone that's dependable. And what people know also is how how capable you are how you're able to fix things I can't do that with every sign that was just easy <laughs> also if you're creating something or working on something and you're not ready to show don't but you can still have a well-rounded life throughout the season you will have moments of even shock and surprise to what you even, of course, someone who does hopefully speak or feel highly about themselves. Uh, moments of understanding where this stem from and why it's important to where you're going next and also no need to rush anything. If there's one thing, you're never rushing, you're just diligently working. However, this time, if you do want to do something on your own, it's really important. It might not come to fruition until more towards August, September. And I can give you more information about that in the second part, which will be in a link below. And all information to work with me will be there in the description. A lot of pentacles. You may feel extremely adamant about whoever is in your life right now. Very... If you're not, if you're single, you are ready to build and ready and kind of waiting for someone. And if you are with someone, you are ready to build, ready to start or make something more serious of this relationship. And if you're not, and if you are in a relationship and if you don't want to make things more serious, you're thinking about it a lot. You're thinking about where possibly that can keep you stuck and what is right in front of you. So for some of you, you may think that there's something like the grass is greener. However, it's not. This person is showing up as your partner, as your equal, your counterpart. You showed up as the king. Here is the queen of pentacles. It could be something about like marriage or what you perceive to be marriage or what you seem to be perceived per partnership is and what you maybe looked at growing up or whatever is rooted within you it's possible that that is where where you're stemming and where the doubt and where you're not ready to where you're getting ready to move forward with but it's not slowly or it's not physically you moving forward yet maybe not talking about it maybe it's time to talk about it more and open up the conversation if you're with someone so this month is really much about partnership but it's also about how you handle your life and how you create it hold on one second you may find that something is trying to take your attention perhaps and it might be good to go with that whatever you may deem a distraction may be actually a helpful 
thing to do, like go play what you may feel like being silly and spontaneous or traveling may feel not like the responsible thing, but right now it is. You're responsible to all parts of yourself. And especially what, if you've created something, if you built something, you worked hard, why not enjoy that as well? You also, the, so it's a big part about creating. This month is showing you where in your life, although you may not be making, like, you may not be making something that has brought you money or brought you like financial success however you find yourself being drawn to that aspect drawn to that aspect drawn to build that that being a part of what you're building now that being implemented in a different in a structure that maybe wasn't before and maybe you found resistance there for a while and now you're finding more ease now you're finding that you have you don't need to overlook or look too far into your past especially with relationships you can now take a look at what's real and what's important what's right in front of you and you want your counterpart you want someone who is for you and what you want and what and a part of this for you and supports you in every aspect you might find yourself contemplative, very contemplative halfway through the month, but it's something that you're not even probably aware of, very cancer season that you're developing at this time. And yet you find yourself dil diligently working, probably actively on something very physical. And that will show you, oh, this was actually face up. We'll take those. Miss you. That helps you come back to yourself that it may be taking your time, but it's not stealing, it's helping you create, it's helping you see something differently than you have before, perhaps. It's about indulging in this sense of self. Um, and the way you also know that this Queen of Pentacles shows up is because when speaking of maybe difficult things or what they want and like just how you're thinking about it they're going to be thinking about it too like what they want and what they're looking for they may something say something very straightforward to you that you almost weren't expecting and it's basically saying this is what i see that you're controlled by sometimes and it could be overindulgence and things that you may be way too heavily on your identity and you're almost like damn and this season's not playing with you yes you can have a lot of fun you can play with it but it's also not playing with you either so if you are unsure then especially around that time and that moment you'll be become sorry that's my kitty very sure about that um that will almost give you an ultimate realization if this person's for you or not because someone needs to be able to check someone who always has it together is always responsible in times when maybe you don't maybe you need someone a second opinion however it is it will in the brighter side of this it will bring you back to and enjoying this part of yourself that you may have been trouble going back and forth with it's may feel a little more intimate and vulnerable with what you're experiencing, but you feel very secure in all other aspects of your life, which helps when you're growing this other part of yourself, when you're creating something that's close to you, when you're not willing to share that just yet. And if you're really thinking about a family, you're understanding what's holding you back, or um, even if you feel like you need to do other things that thing that's pulling you back it could be creation it could be simply creating something it could be the mixture of that and building a family but that's weighing heavily almost on your mind so it's important to give that some thought like you don't have to think out loud but take time when those things come up and give yourself a few minutes just to think about it just to wonder and visualize and see how it makes you feel notice what you f how you feel about that what you feel about that something happened back in airy season around this is a lot of pullback from airy season so like mar end of march and april 
where it caused you to realize how you're not alone anymore. You're not, you may be in this, but you're not alone. And there's something holding you back from feeling fully in, again, maybe a partnership perhaps, or in this space with someone that you feel like is your counterpart. And now, especially by the full moon in Capricorn this month, you will get a very solid explanation in the way that you receive them. It doesn't have to be like a physical thing that happens. It's just this very real experience that you have. And there's a cause for celebration after. There's a cause for enjoyment after. And using this energy in a way that's very helpful for what you're trying to build and who you're becoming. Especially in terms of what you value. And that's holding very firm and showing face in your physical world around you perhaps. And that's causing you to build and let go of maybe even recognize and just let go of things and especially if someone else is bringing it up with you you just you're seeing things clearly and you needed to and you've kind of been waiting for this but almost avoiding it not everyone knows that about you but you will avoid certain things because you're working on this and you you know that's important but we'll address it when it needs to well it's time all right Catherine um um boop -doo -doo. <laughs> The second part will be in the link below, as will everything else. I'm maneuvering things around, but I did just start a podcast as well, and that will be, um, that's on Spotify. It's been nurturing current. I'll put that in the description as well, and I'll see you next month.